Hey, 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 friends. Today we're going to be reviewing the BoxyCharm base box. Now, remember I mentioned last month that I had canceled Premium and Lux. So this is the only BoxyCharm we'll be unboxing this month. But if you are new here, hi, hello, and welcome to our channel. If you're returning, thank you so much for your support. You know I love having everybody so we can chitty chit chat and all of the things. This is the $25 a month subscription. You get five full-sized items and you do get to customize one of them. However, I missed it last month so I didn't get to customize anything. So we'll just see. It's all willy-nilly out there. And then I also have something else. This is not from add-ons. Um, I will explain that in a minute. So if you are interested in any of these things, then please keep on watching. <music> Alrighty, my dear friends, uh, here is the base box for October. It, look at that, it looks like it's been a little roughed up, so hopefully, um, hopefully there's nothing messed up or broken. Here is what the box looks like. Oh, this is pretty cool. BoxyCharm Spellbound. So, usually you get a cardboard, um little thing but this one it looks like they've changed it up oh it gives you all all right this is cool get breaking news it gives you all of the dates and information for pop-up and all of that stuff and then on the back you do receive your variation with the pricing and it looks like they have a little teeny tiny variation number here on the corner so Let's dig in, shall we? The first thing I find in here are the Julep Beauty Makeup Remover Towelettes. Pore Refining with Witch Hazel. So, look at this nice big pack. So, I'm good with this. You know, I use this a lot during recording because I do a lot of swatches on the back of my hand. And sometimes I will record more than one video at a time. So, this is really helpful for doing that. And also, when I do my Instagram mini videos. Um, so, I do like to keep these near my camera as well as use them to, to remove makeup. So, this will not go to waste. So, how much is this little guy? And I love Jewel Up. Like, I think they started out selling nail polish, nail polish subscriptions. And now look at them doing big things. Uh, this is $20 all by itself. So, very nice box for sure. All right, the next thing is the Glow Recipe uh, Watermelon Glow Dew Drops. And, um... Let me see. I will open it. So you guys, I'm not a big fan of Glow Recipe. I feel like it does absolutely nothing for my skin. Um, it's a very popular product and everyone loves it and swears by it. I just have never seen any benefits come from it whatsoever. Uh, so I, I'm probably not going to use this, but look how pretty this bottle is. I'll probably end up giving this to a friend. Looks like it has the pump here. Let's go ahead and smell it. We need smell -o vision Okay, here is what it looks like. We'll rub it on the skin. Like, it barely has a watermelon scent. Like, it's not a scent that's going to stick. And it's not even, like, I have to really try hard to find those notes in here. So, um, this is why I'm saying it's not one of my favorite products. And it feels more gimmicky than anything. But, again, um, I know a lot of people love this product or love their products. So, I can completely understand why it's in the box. This is how much? Glow Recipe. $34 for that guy. Alright, oops. Please hold, I dropped something. Okay. Alright, the next thing we have in here is the... What? Jelly's Beauty Double Sided Wing Stamp Eyeliner. Alright, well that's interesting. Let's see what it... Let's see what we got. 
All right, so it comes like this. And okay, here is one of the stamp sides. Okay, so kind of thick. Kind of thick. I guess um, it will be helpful. I'll give it a try. We'll, we'll give it a whirl. We'll see what it does. Okay, and here is the other tip. So I feel like it kind of bleeds. I don't know if you can see the stamp. It kind of bled in my skin there. So I feel like you have to be really uh, precise with this thing and make sure when you are... Yeah, even the line... Okay, even the line bled as well. Not sure if you could see that. So um, it's definitely something you'll have to be, like you're going to have to work a little extra hard with this. And I think the purpose of this product was to actually make it easier for you. So I think you just have to have a really good steady hand with this. Um, let's see how much this one was. This is $22 for that. Did I show you the stamp side? I don't know that I actually showed you what like what it looked like, even though you saw the stamp on my hand. So there's that. Um, let me know what you guys think about products like these. Have they worked for you? I have not tried one, so we'll play around with it and see, and see what it does, huh? All right, the next item we have in here, ooh. Yes, all right, we got a tint brown brow gel. So it's a lash and brow duo. Oh, okay, so it looks like one side is the brow gel and the other side is the mascara. Oh, I didn't show it to you. So here is what that looks like. Um, nice and thick so here is this let's go ahead we'll start with the brow gel side oh yes oh so this is perfect because I ran out of the milk I use the brand milk for my uh, gel my <laughs> my brow gel so this is actually perfect timing it did come out a little bit thick on the top there um, but I don't think it's anything to worry about. Let's see what that consistency on the skin is like. All right, here is just the what the formula looks like since we don't really have anything to try it on. And let's see what the mascara side. Oh, okay. So it looks like here is where the product is and then this is a really nice tight brush. I think it will work very well. Um, I think like, you know, if you use your regular mascara and then you use the second one, I think this will be wonderful for that type of thing. So there's that guy. Let's see how much it is. Uh, this is $30, well, $29. So just this product alone pays for the box. So that's always nice. And the last, but of course the most funnest part, is the eyeshadow palette. This is the Ace Beauté Falling For You. Looks like their fall eyeshadow palette. This is a really good brand. They are, I feel like, underrated. They definitely have great quality formula. Look at how big and nice these pans are. A lot of shimmery colors. I love the fall colors. Let's go ahead and do these two matte colors right here. And let's give it a swatch. Ooh. So looks like, there we go. So that's just with one swatch going in. Let's go ahead and try a glittery color. We'll try this one. Ooh, this one is called, this one right here is called Apple. Let's go ahead and give Apple a whirl. And ooh, look at that. Very nice and shiny. Let's see what it does on the skin. Yeah, look at that. Ooh, you can make such beautiful fall um, eyelid colors with that. Very happy with that. What is this price? Uh, 
$34.99. So definitely got our values worth. I will total it up and put it over here. What did you guys think? Did you enjoy October's box? I mean, I really liked it. So what is in this box, you might say? <laughs> is it add-ons? No, actually I did not get add-ons. So if you watched last month's video, I received the Rare Beauty palette and the shimmery color in there was so messed up. Um, I couldn't salvage it in any way. Um, not probably not BoxyCharm's fault. It just happens in transit with, you know, packages get throwing around, thrown around and whatnot. But I did reach out to them. It was fairly easy. I did have to provide a photo and I'll put that here because I still have the photo. Um, and I just let them know like, hey, this was what happened. It's all messed up. Now they did offer a replacement. However, of course that palette was sold out and not available. So this is... So this is my replacement item. It is the Rare Beauty Blot and Glow Touch Up Kit in Translucent. I wasn't particularly excited about that, however, um, I did appreciate the fact that they were willing to fix it. I wish they would have gave me like a choice or an option between a couple of things. That would have been cool. Um, Again, it was my first experience with having to deal with customer service, and I think they did an all right job for it being a bot. <laughs> but um, here is what that looks like. And so it's a nice, cute little pill-shaped case. Here is what it looks like on the inside. I have no idea. So here is the... I do not know how to work this apparently, but here is the blotting pad, I guess. And then here is the sheets. So, and it does come with a mirror. I don't know here. It's weird because the thing, the color says translucent, so I thought that maybe there was an actual powder. Um, Oh, okay, so it's kind of like, here are the sheets, it looks like you pull them out kind of like tissue, and then you blot. Uh, what exactly do you use this for? Um, I do not know. Blotting powder. So it does say blotting powder, is there like powder in here? It's weird. This says, this little thing, I know it's like, that's translucent, but in here it says that this is the blotting powder. Is the powder inside of this thing? I have no clue, you guys, but anyway, this was, um pretty much a free gift or, you know, for the replacement. I think it was very nice that they did that. Um, I don't think I'll be, I probably won't use it. I don't feel like my face gets that oily. So, um, I, I mean, maybe I should just give it a try since I have it. I mean, why not? Anyway, you guys, um, thank you for joining me for this unboxing. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram. We will see you in our next video. Bye.